You may have heard about the AI-generated influencer model. Many virtual influencers are doing outstanding jobs nowadays. We have already made videos on how we can create virtual influencers. But the process was complex and you had to do so much work. However, I found an amazing new AI tool, which can create an AI influencer in just a few clicks. And in this video, I will explore that tool. So, without further ado, let's dive in. Introducing RenderNet.ai It's an amazing AI image generator with more control. With this tool, you can generate consistent character images with the face lock feature. Generate images in an exact pose with ControlNet. There are many other features available on this tool. Alright, to get started, go to the description box and click on the RenderNet AI link. After coming to this page, click on the Create for Free button. Now create an account with your email or Google account. I already have an account, so, I am logging in. After creating the account, your interface will be like this one. Here you can see some options for image generation. First, here you can generate images with text prompts. After that, the AI influencer. With this tool, you can generate unlimited images for your AI influencer. After that, the bokeh tool, here you can generate high-quality images with a blurred background. Then, the iPhone photo, with this tool, you can generate candid shots with easy prompting. Next, with ContraNet, you can generate images in selected poses. And in the end, with FaceLock, you can generate images with any face. As we are making an AI influencer, let's select the AI influencer tool to generate AI influencer images. First, we have to upload a reference image. So, first, we have to create our first image. To do that, turn off the face lock option from here and then delete the reference image. After that, come to the Model tab. You can access it from the Studio tab of the home page. Here you will notice a vast number of models in different styles. As we want to generate a hyper-realistic AI model, select the Photoreal style. Now you will find the Photoreal model. You have to select a model from here. I will suggest going with Juggernaut XL. There is an interesting feature of RenderNet. You can use multiple models at one time. Yes, you can generate images with multiple models. Let's try that feature. I will select four models at one time. Which model will provide better results, we will use it later. Okay, after selecting the model, come to the setting tab. Here you can set the seed, sampler, steps, AI guidance, batch size, and aspect ratio. I will use the default setting. Just changing the aspect ratio to 1 to 1. After setting, come to the LoRa, here you will find some fine-tune LoRa model. You can use LoRa to fine-tune your images. This time I am skipping it. Next, as we are generating the first image for our model, we don't need to use the control net and face lock options. Alright, now come to the prompt box. Enter a detailed prompt to generate a great face. I am entering a ready prompt. I used to generate one of my influencer models. I will put the prompt in the description box. You can use it or can customize it. Okay, now come to the negative prompt. Negative prompt means what you don't want in your image. There are some pre-built prompts here. That's perfect for me. Now hit the generate button from here. Now RenderNet will take some time to generate the images. Let's fast forward this part. And here it is. RenderNet generates four images for us. Now find the best image. In my case, I am going to use this image as my new AI influencer. Here you can see the model name. Next time I will use this model, you can use any model. Now click on face lock from here to generate more influencer images with the same face. And RenderNet is ready to generate images with the same face. Now you can change the base model if you want, then customize the setting and add LoRa. After that, customize the prompt and hit the generate button to generate new images. And here it is. It generates four images this time. You can see the results. That's just amazing. Every image has a similar face. And the image quality is just amazing. Now if you want to download any single image, just click on it. After that, click on the three dot menu and then select download. And if you want to download all of the images, just click on the download icon from here. All of the images will be downloaded on your device as a zip file. 
Alright, now we can generate images with the same face. But what if you want to generate images with a particular face and pose? You can do it with the Control Net option. After coming to the Control Net tab, delete the existing pose. Now upload an image or pose here. After that, set the Control Net preprocessor according to your base model. As my base model is based on SDXL, I'm changing it to Canny. After that, set the control mode and resize mode. In the control mode, I will select prompt is more important and keep resize mode as usual. After that, you can customize the prompt if you want. After all is set, hit the generate button. And here it is. You can see that RenderNet generates images with our model in the pose of our reference image. In this way, you can generate unlimited images for your fake influencer model with RenderNet in various poses but with the same face. There are some other options also available here, such as you can generate and edit images in canvas mode. Another interesting feature is the prompt generating assistance. Yes, here you will get live assistance on generating prompts. Just enter your topic and an expert will generate prompts for you. RenderNet is a gem for those who are looking for a dedicated AI influencer generator and others who want to generate pro-level images in various styles. Alright, now let's talk about the pricing of this tool. It will give you 10 free credits to test the tool. If you want to buy additional credits, click on Buy Credits from here. There are three plans. You will get 1,000 credits only for $9. 2,500 credits for $25 and 5,000 credits for $35. Every image generation costs one credit. That means you have to pay only $35 to generate 5,000 images. That's really affordable and value for money, as it gives you a commercial license. Alright, friends, I will wrap up our video now. Before that, I would love to hear about your experience with generating consistent character images for fake influencers with AI. Share your thoughts and results in the comments section below. Don't forget to like this video if you found it helpful and subscribe to our channel for more amazing tutorials like this one. Thank you so much for watching, and until next time, happy creating!